Hi, welcome to day two of multiplying and dividing fractions. So yesterday we multiplied fractions, which was just multiplying the numerators by the numerator by the numerator and the denominator by the denominator. When you divide a fraction, it's going to be a little bit different. So what you're actually going to do is you're going to take the inverse of the second fraction. Okay, so the inverse of 7 elevenths would be 11 sevenths. It would be the opposite. And then we're going to cross that. And instead of dividing, we're actually going to multiply. So then we're going to do what we did yesterday. 3 times 11 is 33. It's a weird 33. And then 5 times 7 is 35. That makes that 33 a little bit better there. So that's what you do. Okay, you're going to flip the second fraction and then you're actually going to multiply just like we did yesterday. No dividing involved. It's a little weird that when you're dividing, you're not dividing, but that's how it's going to work for fractions. So we're going to flip the second number. It's one fourth. We're going to make it four over one. And instead of Dividing, we're going to be multiplying. So we're going to do 10 times 4, which is 40, and then 2 times 1, which is 2. Now, if the denominator goes into the numerator equal, in equal amount of times, then this is actually going to be a whole number. So this is the same as 40 divided by 2. Now you actually are dividing in this case. So to simplify this, 40 divided by 2 is 20. Or 2 goes into 40 20 times. So in that case, we're not going to do the mixed numbers yet, but we are going to simplify if it can be a whole number. 40 divided by 2 is 20. Okay. And... Ooh, that's not the right spot. Let's try that again. Okay, so once again, we're going to flip this or um, take the inverse, which would be 7 over 1. You just cross that out. If it's confusing for you, you can cross that out. And we're going to multiply. 5 times 7 is 35. 4 times 1 is 4. Now, 4 does not go into 35 equally, so this is not a whole number. This would be a mixed number answer, and we're not getting into those today. So we're just going to leave it as 35 fourths. Okay, well, I hope that helps you out, and good luck on your practice. We'll talk to you again soon. Bye.